What's up, guys? Hope you're doing well. It's been a long time since I've seen y'all, man. Like, my internet has been fucking up for the past four days, man. But I'm back, and I've been missing y'all, man. I've been watching freaking all anime and stuff, but I just couldn't upload nothing because my internet has been fucking messing up, man. This is the second time this shit done done this, but... All right, fucking let's get into this, man. I'm so ready to get back into this, man. Fucking this episode of Naruto was so fucking hype for me. Like, I didn't read the manga from from where Naruto... I didn't read the manga from where God decided... Like, I stopped reading to when God decided he was going to take our own Madara. Like, that's when I stopped reading. I didn't read no more of the Naruto, like, Naruto Shippuden canon. Like, I didn't read no more. I don't know what happened at the end. Well, I kind of know what happened at the end of the manga because everybody was fucking talking about it. And you really couldn't avoid it. Like, even, like, some of my friends and shit kept fucking spoiling the fucking end for me because, like, it was just so damn good. And the, what they thought, like, I don't know. But it was just so damn good that they just could not fucking keep it secret. And everybody in the anime community on fucking YouTube was talking about the shit. So, hey. But freaking, I didn't know that when the Sage of Six Paths had gave Naruto and Sasuke their freaking powers, that all, I don't know if half the QB, like all the Jin Chitter, half all, half of, okay, okay. Half of all the Jin Chitter freaking uh, chakra was inside of Naruto. Like, I didn't know that. Like, that was really fucking strange to me. Like, it was fucking hype when he asked freaking Goku, the uh, four tails, for some of his chakra, and he had, like, a lava ball Rasengan shuriken and jump. Like, that shit was fucking epic as I don't know what, man. And Naruto wasn't even in uh, Biju mode. He was just in regular Naruto mode when he kicked back that freaking, um, that little black ball that was coming to kick Guy. For uh, that moderator has sent to come kill God Jump. Like, he was in that mode and he freaking destroyed. No, nah, he didn't destroy it, but he cut down the eternal tree. I was like, damn, like, that shit was so fucking hyped to me. I was, I was fucking jumping off the. Well, when I saw this, I was in Books a Million and shit. So I really couldn't go, yeah, but I was like, ugh. <laughs> that was fucking quiet and jump, man. But damn, man, like, I did not know that. I, I forgot. Like, hold up, man. When somebody please explain this to me and refer me an episode because I don't remember freaking Naruto having or even somebody putting the all all of the Jin Chiriki's, uh like half of their power inside of Naruto. Like, I don't remember that. Or hold, hold up, I'm starting to remember something right now. Like, I think it was like, um. Like, uh, like, damn, fuck, man. I think it was when uh, Naruto, Naruto was about to take on Obito, like, at the like the very end conclusion, where, where everybody was like, all the the whole entire Ninja Alliance was at the battleground. Now that Madara is fighting Naruto and Sasuke, at, like. I think that's when all, like, the Bijus and their uh, previous um, uh, Jin Chiriki were, like, um, did, like, this, like, a Naruto and, like, uh, Killer B, like, fist bump, and they gave Naruto that freaking chakra and stuff. Like, um, all the tail beasts, not the Jin Chiriki, the Jin Chiriki are the people, all the tail beasts, my bad. But I think that's when that happened. Because this kind of threw me off again, man. Like, I'm remembering something, but I'm not fully sure. If you know, please put it in the comments to let me know, man. Because I'm not fully really sure. I think I kind of know. Then again, I'm like, uh, like, I don't, I just forgot, man. But I don't know why. And this is another thing that, like, had me go, hmm. But I don't know why every time Naruto get a power up, he looks different. But every time freaking Sasuke gets a power up, he doesn't look different. Only time Sasuke got a power up and he looked different was in the first, like, Naruto thing when they was kids. Like, that's the only time, man. Like, after Orochimaru put the curse mark on him 
and he had those like little like hand wings and he like every time he used to use that power his hair grew and all that shit it was like a black cross on black X on his nose damn fucking Dr. Pepper fucking making me burp doing my fucking video but one take that's all I'm doing <laughs> authentic nigga and honest I think that's the only time man cause like Sasuke at least and this is like what I want to happen like Sasuke at least should look different a little bit when he freaking gets a power up Kishi just keeps Sasuke looking the same like why can't Sasuke when he got that power up have the Uchiha freaking um, armor on that uh, Madara had on when he fought against uh, the Suchikage and the Kazakage in the desert. Like that armor Madara had on. Why can't Sasuke have on that armor? And like, so he can look different so we can know that he, got, he has a power up instead of looking at his eye because sometimes like, sometimes you miss that. I know, um, well, I don't miss it, but I know some people do. Sometimes they miss the looking at his freaking eyes and stuff. I know his powers behind his eyes, the visual, all that, yes. But Naruto always looks freaking different every time he, and I understand Naruto, the main character. He got to look different and all that. But Naruto, every time Naruto has gotten a power up, he has looked different. And every time Sasuke has gotten a power up, he has looked the same. The only time Sasuke has ever changed was when he was wearing that white long little uh like shirt or whatever and the freaking purple shirt he wearing now that's it like what the fuck is that man like you don't know how strong that nigga is like, just from that like come on man like it's just ugh. like ugh. that's just one thing to where i just wanted kishi to freaking dudes, like, at least make Sasuke look a little different, have him, like, when Naruto is, um, radiating, like, the nine tails, freaking, uh, chakra and stuff, like, have Sasuke radiating some purple freaking chakra or something, like, just something to look a little bit different, man, and I saw, like, a couple of, uh, anime reviews before I did my freaking video and shit, and, they kept talking about how the fucking animation wasn't looking all that good. I was like, uh, um, I don't know. <laughs> like, uh, I thought the animation was kind of good. Like, I thought it was good. Again, I'm not an anime buff. Uh, I am an anime buff, but I'm not an animation buff. That's what I meant to say. Like, I really don't look too much at the animation. Like, but if it looks good enough, to where it wows me when I see it, I'm fine with it. Like, I really, like, what's wrong? Like, what are y'all talking about? Like, and I know some people, like, can argue, well, the art in this really doesn't match up to the art in some other things. But I'm like, look, I don't give a damn, man. <laughs> like, I know I'm probably, you probably go, <gasps> will you hear that? But it's like, I just don't care. Like, if it's visually stimulating to me, I'm cool. Like, I'm super good, man. But it's like with, and, and I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I'm going to break the fourth wall for y'all. If y'all don't know, I'm going to go ahead and break it, man. Fuck it. Well, I'm putting it out there. The only people that bitch about the art a lot is like artists that like anime. Like no regular person like me that loves anime likes like bitch about the art like nobody like that's the only like that's i mean some people do look at the animation and go you know what this animation for this episode was great but what the hell happened to this episode like why does this episode look like shit and then this episode looks like fucking a masterpiece or like a movie or something like i don't know man i can't tell you but all i know is if the characters still look like the character, just like freaking Dragon Ball Z, how everybody was fucking bitching and shit, um, how uh, when Goku went Super Saiyan 3, he didn't look nothing like Super Saiyan 3, and I was just like, um, I don't think I looked that close or paused the video to freaking see like all the art and shit that was in the fucking, how they drew him and all that, because... When I watched it, I'm going to go and tell y'all. When I watched it, I was like, 
Damn, Super Saiyan 3, nostalgic. All right, let's go. What? Y'all don't like the animation? Um, I wasn't looking at him that close. Like, I wasn't even paying attention to his face and, like, how they drew him. Like, did you fucking pause the video or something? That's what I was fucking, like... When I saw reviewers and everybody else talking about, oh, the animation sucks, all this and that, and I was like, um, you must have paused the video. Because when I saw it, it looked, I'm gonna be honest, like, to me, it looked like Goku. That's Super Saiyan 3 Goku. But it's like, uh, what, man? Like, and then they had some freaking, like, on Anime Amino, the app I get on, they had some freaking side by side of, like, Way back in the day, like 90s style fucking art and animation, uh, Super Saiyan 3 to like nowadays art and animation Super Saiyan 3. And I was just like, man, come on, man. Like, I didn't know y'all was like that for real. But I'm telling you, man, uh, they, I'm telling you right now, man, the only people that bitch about the art and animation and me heavily in freaking anime in general is artists who like anime. Like, they the only people that fucking bitch about it, man. Other than that, I don't nobody bitch about no art and animation that's in anime. Like, nobody bitches about it, man. Like, I don't bitch about it at all. Like, now, it is some times to where I go, what in the world is this? That don't look like the person at all, man. I don't know what this is, but other than that, man, I just enjoy it for what it is, man. But freaking, oh, yeah, and I found out that we gonna have some freaking filler like, we're going to have two more episodes of canon. Then after those two episodes, we're going to have the freaking um, 1010 Gaiden. Something like that. Like Kakashi Gaiden. To where it showed Kakashi growing up, his dad dying, how he joined Minato and all them. And like Anbu Black Ops and all that. Like, we're going to have that for freaking 1010. It's going to be called Road to 1010. And I was like, look, man, I, I'm actually one of the few people that likes 1010. But damn, heck no, dude. I don't want to see that shit at all, man. Like, I just got done bitching about us being um, gone for completely December of last year till June. We had nothing but filler. From December, from what I can remember correctly, from December of last year to June of this year. And then we have, we come back have one episode of canon, they go right back to filler, then we come back out of that filler, have like maybe like three to four episodes of canon, then we now, we gonna have two more episodes of canon, and then we going straight into filler again, man. Like, I don't know if they just trying to put us in filler because they trying to work on a Boruto shit, and like Kishi thinking about really making that the next Naruto series, like the Boruto series. They should call it Sarada, but whatever. I don't know if they doing that. That's like one of my theories for them keep freaking bringing back the stupid tail filler that nobody wants to see. Like, that probably is the reason, but damn, man. Like, nobody wants to watch this fucking filler. Like, who wants... Do y'all want to watch this freaking filler? Because I know I don't. Like, God. Ugh. But, man, tell me what you think, man. Do you think that freaking we going in this filler because of... Uh, they were trying to, um, Kishi actually is really thinking about making the Boruto series a, a spinoff of the Naruto series. And it's really going to be like the uh, uh, Boruto um, slash Naruto or whatever you want to call it. Like next Shippuden, whatever series like Naruto. Let me know in the comments, man. And what's your thoughts about uh, this episode of Naruto? I know I'll straight away a little bit, man. But this is my first video back. I'm just trying to get... A lot off my mind that I've been fucking seeing around the community and stuff. And, like, it's just great. I'm glad to be back. I'm glad to be back doing fucking YouTube. Like, um, not really daily, but, like, daily. Like, I'm put up a lot of videos, man. But I'm going back to school and shit, so I'm really not going to have the time to put up as many videos as I would like. But I will be putting up some videos, man. So, y'all stay tuned for that, man. But... Yeah, and over, your overall thoughts of this fucking episode, man. Put it down in the comments. But before you do that, 
Like this video if you like this video. Dislike it if you don't. I don't care just let me know somebody watching my shit. And subscribe if you haven't already, man. It's fucking free. Stay up to date with my videos. Stay looking at me and my face and my shirts. My Adidas shirts. Stay looking at Trigon Full Metal. That greatness, that awesomeness back there. That got me into anime. Just like Naruto. And I started loving it and all that, man. You know all that bullshit. That fucking YouTube's tell y'all to connive y'all. Trick y'all. And subscribing to them too, man. I'm going to do the same thing too, nigga. I'm trying to reach 100,000 subscribers, man. If I reach 100,000 subscribers... I feel like I made it in this community. If I reach freaking a thousand subscribers now, I feel like I made it. But my goal is a hundred thousand. But man, if I reach a hundred, I'll be fucking happy with that and I love it. And I give all that love back to y'all, man, by putting up this great content and these videos that y'all love to watch and stuff, man. But yeah, man, that's all I got to say, man. Tell me what you had for dinner last night. I had a burger and fries. It was fucking great. Like, I loved it, man. But that's all I got for this video, man. I'm great. Glad to be back. Great to be back. More videos coming in the future, man. Y'all stay tuned. But and subscribe. I'm out, man. Peace. Take it easy. I love your faces. That's a closet. <laughs>